Hey guys, welcome back to MindBuild77. My name is Liam, and today we're going to be looking at and analyzing the 1977 SETI WO signal. So before I actually go and analyze the audio track, I'm going to give you guys a little bit of background and story behind um, the 1977 WO signal. So in August of 1977, SETI picked up this signal that was coming from the constellation Sagittarius, or at least that's where they detected it coming from. So the signal was coming from around that section of the galaxy, or at least that handful of stars, and that's what they think. So many people debunk this signal saying that it's just a comment, but later in this video, after I listen to the um, woe signal, the actual sound to it, which you can see behind there, I'm actually going to be listening to another uh, radio wave that was from a comet, because then we can compare the two and see like if they're similar or not similar, and I know that there's like a ton of other stuff that you have to take into consideration, but we're just gonna, you know, listen to it and see what we find uh, right away. Um, so I'm going to be playing for you guys and analyzing the um, woe signal right here, um, so enjoy it. Okay, hey guys, so here we're going to be listening to the uh, audio track for the signal. Um, you know, you could analyze it yourself and tell me what you think um, and tell me where I went wrong, but um, here we go. This is my analyzing of this um, audio track or this transmission, whatever you want to call it. Let's just see what it entails, and I haven't really thoroughly listened to it before, so I'm going to listen to it once throughout right now. Okay, so something's happening. This weird, like, whistle sound is coming. It's a little bit loud. Okay, so it's coming, like, in and out, so I'm not sure. There's also this other, um, deeper sound behind it. I'm not sure what that rattling is. Like, do you, do you guys know what I mean? Like, there's this rattling noise behind this, uh, high-pitched squeak. It almost sounds like, I don't know. It's weird that it repeats, this like signal repeats over and over. Like the same, da 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 da. Yeah, there it goes again. Yeah, it, it definitely repeats. I'm not sure if a comment would repeat this, you know, precisely. There it goes again. Pretty loud. This other thing behind it, I'm not sure what that is. And then that squeaking. Okay, so that was the audio track. So, pretty interesting. I'm not sure if comets do that, um, because people do think that it is just a comet that's been picked up, but I mean, that high-pitched squeak sound in the background, I could hear, you know, like, it repeats that da, 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 over and over and over throughout the minute or so that this, you know, track plays out. And then there's also this, like, rumbling sound behind it, or rattling, I'm not sure, but it's like a deep noise that sounds like rumbling. I'm not really sure what that is. Um, I'm not sure if it has anything to do with that other high-pitched sound, or maybe that's just normal. Um, but it definitely does sound like this high-pitched, like, um, squeal or something like that. It definitely does seem like it repeats over and over because it's the same uh, beats or melody um, that's, like, throughout the whole track. So I'm not really sure what that means, because if this was an alien race or alien species trying to contact us, I mean, there wouldn't really be any way for us to interpret, you know, their signals or whatever. Um, but again, that would be assuming that they use radio or whatever. Um, I'm not sure what it is, but um, let's take a look now at a comet, and it's the same sort of like electro um, waves that we get picked up and, you know, we ran it through um, some audio. Um, so I'm going to be listening to that and pointing out some similarities, and you guys can too. Um, it's just to compare the two, because if we just listen to this, we're not really sure what's normal and what's not. So let's check out this comment. So this one's called Rosetta's Comet or something. Again, all the links to the videos are down below. Um, we're not going to listen to the whole thing, but let's just hear what it sounds like uh, at the beginning. So it's like a popping sound. Or like a woodpecker. Definitely does already sound very different from the other one. But let's keep on going and see. Um, it changes in pitch, so um, it does change like the other one, but it does sound very different. They don't sound the same at all. It's getting higher. 
It almost sounds like frogs or something. It's interesting too. Yeah, uh, this does not sound at all like the um, 1977 SETI one at all. Um, this one sounds, you know, it's con it's not, it variates. There's no like consistency throughout the sound. The other one, it was the same beats over and over. And they just sound very different. Yeah, interesting. So yeah, very different. And I'm not sure how different, like, if we compared this comment to another comment that we know is a comment, I'm not sure how much difference there would be. Um, but it definitely does sound different, that's what I can say. They sound nothing alike. Um, this one, you know, it sounds like, you know, frogs or a woodpecker, like the closest, you know, um, thing that I could put it to. And then the other one, it sounds like a transmission. And I mean, I'm not saying that they're out, that they are aliens transmitting in that particular case, because we're not really sure if these aliens even use radio, because that's sort of an assumption. Um, but it does definitely doesn't sound like a comment to me. Uh, I mean, you guys might think differently, but definitely tell me and tell me where I went wrong. So definitely very, very interesting. I encourage you guys to figure out um, what you think of this by yourself. Leave a comment because I'll respond to it. Um, you know, whatever you want to say. Um, but I definitely do think that this is not a comment. Um, again, I could be 100% wrong, but that's what I'm going to say for this video. Do you think that it's like an alien transmission or do you think that it is just, you know, some celestial body or something? But it is from a different star system, so I'm not really sure if we could pick up you know, a comment like radio waves that far away. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you found it informative or, you know, you just got something out of it or enjoyed it. And to everyone else who's here, like my subscribers, I hope that you like the return of my, you know, analyzing videos. I haven't done one of them in a long time. So I thought that it'd be nice to do one again, but with the topics that I'm doing now. But anyway, thank you guys very much for watching this video. This is MindBuild77 signing off till next time. Bye guys.